Hello, this is Jenny from Healing the Wounded Heart. The love of God is something so amazing that we will never ever really understand it, will we? Yes, we know that God loved the world so much and that's why he sent his only son Jesus into our world to ultimately bring us back into relationship with himself through the death of his son Jesus Christ on the cross and his resurrection. We are also extremely grateful that God has personally revealed his love for each one of us. Yes, absolutely incredible. So we love him now whom we have never actually seen with our physical eyes. Wow. We cannot ever earn the love of God and we cannot ever lose the love of God. God doesn't wake up one morning and think, I am not going to love you or me today because of how much we have messed up the day before. His love is totally unconditional. He loves us because he loves us and that's it. I think that because we are so aware of our own faults and failings that we often wonder how he can possibly love us. Our faults, failings and mistakes are certainly no surprise to him. He does not say, I will only love you if you are good in every way, all of the time. No. I don't have a child of my own, but my understanding is that the parent will always love the child regardless of what perhaps that child has done wrong, simply because that child belongs to its parent. In a similar way, God is our loving Father, and regardless of what we may or may not do, he simply cannot help but love us. It's so encouraging for us to know that things may change, but the love of God remains constant towards each and every one of us. Isaiah chapter 54 verse 10 reminds us of this. Though the mountains be shaken and the hills be removed, yet my unfailing love for you will not be shaken, nor my covenant of peace be removed, says the Lord who has compassion on you. How wonderful that is. My prayer is this. May the Lord open up the eyes of our hearts more to understand the height and the depth that the love of God has for each one of us. God bless you. Amen.